Get it. Time right, now. Time now for round two of Coffee Talk, friends. Have you ever caught yourself saying, I will never parent the way my parents did? Well, chances, I've heard my kids say that. <laughs> chances are your kids are saying the same thing about you. Maybe to your face. Uh, the truth, though, is this. Parenting like your parents did isn't necessarily a bad thing. Or so that's what they say in an article on parents. The article claims that oftentimes each generation of parents wants to improve upon the last, sometimes, though, taking it a bit too far. For example, Gen X parents were typically latchkey kids who feel like they received little supervision or support. So if you're a Gen Xer who felt underparented, you might overcompensate and indulge your child's emotions a little too much, which can cause its own set of problems. Now, because I know everybody's wondering what the article says about their specific generation of parenting, let's begin, shall we? Generation X were raised largely by the boomers who kind of use the helicopter parenting style. Millennials tend to be more open-minded than any of the generations before them. <laughs> Therefore, they find value in positive parenting over authoritarian discipline. Finally, Generation Z parents aspire to be perfect and compare themselves to other parents on social media there it is okay any of that ring true so yes, yes. <laughs> you know, and i think about this a lot because i am an older parent first time parent but i'm old let's be honest and i go back to something what does that make me <laughs> yep. old. Yep. <laughs> an old parent too but a young grandpa Anyway, anyway, I go back to things that you have said a lot about your parenting journey oh, and geez. how you remember, you don't remember your dad or mom getting down on the floor and like crawling with you. I don't. And, uh, and you turned out really, really well. So on the days <laughs> where I feel like I haven't been as much involved with Leo as I should be because I'm pregnant and getting on the floor is really hard right now. I think, well, Matt turned out great, and there were days his <laughs> wow, parents Wow, if that's the part you're going to say. Well, but I, so Leo's going to be okay. <laughs> if I can pass along any wisdom, uh, it would be, and this is a big one for me, that there comes a time when you, when you realize that your parents were flawed in some way. And then there comes a time when you realize everyone is flawed right we're all gonna make mistakes we're all gonna do things that that we could have been better at our parents us our kids and and so you find a way around that and you stop making excuses about it but I think that 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 when you come to that realization it's a it's a big moment and you go Okay, I get it. We're not perfect, right? And mom and dad weren't superheroes. Right, but they were doing the best that they could under their circumstances, and I tried to do the best I could under my circumstances. Yeah, I think that sums it up nicely. Okay. We're all hosed. That's the right. bottom line. <laughs> Nobody's got it figured out. You said hosed, right? I did. Yes. Okay. We, <laughs> okay. To be clear, that <laughs> brings us to our... Our Facebook question, are you well? No. no. Uh, what phrases do you use that your parents used on you? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Head on over oh. to our Facebook page. Don't oh. worry about it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you knew where I, my head was. Yeah. Don't worry about There's it. There's All right. a Frank Hedegerism yeah. that I use mm -hmm. that I can't say. I would buy that book. I'd buy that little, like, quote a day. <laughs> it's pretty good. Right.